What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be talking about the market and some of the stocks that have been holding and this market has been pretty volatile right now. You can see we're looking at the SPY right here right now. And right now we're currently under the VWAP right here. But everybody's big question is, is it going to break to a new high or is it going to hit this resistance and then are we going to start a depression? And I'm telling you, nobody knows that. Nobody knows what's going to happen with this. But the SPY is definitely something you want to look at before you get into trading this just to see what it's doing. Because if this is dumping, it's not a good time to buy until it actually stops. So here's MBRV right here. I actually had this up for a swing trade because of the catalyst that was coming up with it. And their drug did pass, so the FDA did approve it. But one thing you got to learn about these pharmaceutical companies, there is so much manipulation in these. It's unbelievable. And I do like trading them, but this kind of turns me off when this kind of stuff happens. Because this stock halted at about 3 o'clock or so, and then it didn't resume trading until basically after hours. And if you can't trade after hours, you're basically screwed anyways. But if you can, you're screwed also because it pumped up to $3 and then it dumped immediately. So you basically had to sell your shares very quickly if you wanted to get out of the stock. And this normally does not happen when the FDA approves a drug like this. And as of right now, I heard people saying, oh, I'm buying the dip, I'm buying the dip. You do not want to buy this dip right now because you are catching a, a very sharp knife dropping. Yes, I understand when you want to lower your average, but this thing has a lot more room to fall right now. And looking at it right now, you're probably going to end up hitting support maybe right around 150 ish it's basically from this downtrend pattern right here but if you really do like this stock a lot and you want to get in it I would just say put a limit order in right around three dollars because if the stock does get over three dollars I think it's gonna start to run but since their drug was approved they actually should be starting to start selling it within a month or two that's gonna help them get some revenue in here and their earnings let's see their earnings are gonna be right around 11 6 right around that area so just with the market being all crazy and everything I actually have been day trading because I don't want to stay in a stock very long so this right here has been a really good day trading stock RKDA but it definitely is overextended here a little bit I think it's gonna start down and we're to see if it hits the support right here right around eight dollars and do a little bit of consolidation and then boom and then right back up to as high as again oh look i found some mbrv mm, i'm gonna put this away 